Agni versus Gera. Oh, never mind. Magic <laughs> will show no mercy for Kaz. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people are probably playing patron. Like, like what was what was popular at this point? Mech Mage, I guess. Patron Warrior, Handlock, um, Miracle Rogue, I think was still a thing. Which actually, actually, probably not in Twist because, um, was it Auctioneer was nerfed so many times. So I bet you Miracle Rogue isn't even viable in Twist. Which, again, makes me kind of wish that they, um, you know, brought back the nerfs and buffs. It's actually funny how many of these... I forgot how many of these cards I had in Golden. Because I crafted these all Golden back in the day. Because, like, all I played was Control Warrior for a long, long time. There's double Taskmaster. Even the uh, Death Spite. <laughs> You got those for free from the adventure, but I crafted the golden versions when they gave you the option to. Um. Let's drop this now. I wish I wish I had some face damage there, because if I did, I would have battle rage for two. But it kind of feels bad doing it for one. Four mana. Oh. Okay, so that's dying next turn. Uh, that's kind of nice. The question is, I guess, yeah, I missed one trigger, but the question is, do I just raw dog a frothing berserker here? He could swing, trade, and execute it. But if he doesn't execute, it's a lot of potential damage on the board. You gotta risk it for the biscuit. Cause I got whirlwind, battle rage, inner rage. Okay, at least he's not giving his charge. Okay, <laughs> just playing a mirror match here. Oh man. Um, man, this is. It's funny when, like, the combos don't go like you expect them to. Actually, you know, a whirlwind first. I'm gonna execute his frothing. Or do I just inner rage it? Three extra damage. Oh, I just win. <laughs> I was so focused on um, like clearing the board and kind of like optimal plays, I didn't even realize. Okay, I was just talking about Rogue actually, so. I guess we'll see if Combo Rogue is a thing or not. Funny enough, third game now, and it's the first game, first game I've actually even seen Patron. Axe is nice. Okay, we got two of them there. Just need, uh, actually, don't even need the um, Rotting Berserker. What does Rogue have at this point? It has Sap and Vanish. Vanish could be annoying. That, it, that didn't even have an animation or anything? Half the reason I used that was just, I haven't had the chance to play it yet, and I just wanted to see the animation. Wow. If that is not in spirit with the 
10 year celebration. I, I don't know what is. It's hilarious. Yeah, it's just like, um, what they played, like Questing Adventurer was a big one back then. Um, Edwin, obviously. Um, I guess it's a swing because I want to play to get the death fight out. This hand's a little awkward. Getting another Warsong Commander. The end is coming. That's fine. Not like I was going to pop off next turn anyways. That was a really weird drop for him because, say, like, I was a drop Emperor, right? Like, it's, I have four mana, I don't have the coin. If I had the coin still in hand, that would have been great. Because you could have uh, stopped Emperor or Patron. Also, very weird that Rogue is playing Doomsayer. Okay. Give me more combo pieces. <laughs> like a mill rogue. Um. And I haven't even drawn uh, Thoris in once either. I need eight mana for this. Although next turn I could just... Drop Patron, Swing, Inner Rage, make a couple more. Okay. What, outside of Vanish, what would his answer be? What did I burn there? Battle Rage, that's fine. Okay, yeah, burn all the draw, that's fine. Yeah, I think I'll do that though. We'll see if he uh, has a way. Zombie Chow. What is happening? Yeah, it's still fine. My hand is full. Yeah, he killed one. Oh, I lost the fraud thing. Leave at least one alive. Can we just kill him now? Not without the frost thing, but... We can clear the board. We have one frothing left. That's our win con at this point. Go face with everything. So we have Warsong. I think it's going to come down to like Warsong Commander, Unstable Ghoul, Frothing. Try and get a win that way. We got the World Taskmaster too. Not that bad. And still, the weapon deals three more damage. Death bite. Cause because like I've kind of said, right? There there's not a whole lot of like healing and Okay. <laughs> there's not a whole lot of like healing and defensive options at this point in the game. Especially for rogue. So I yeah, I just could just hammer this guy's face and win. Um Seven. I'm one mana off. I could have Warsong Commander, Patron, um, Cruel Taskmastered it and won that way. I'll just drop both of these. Drop some hand size. So he's got Bran. He 
He's got some cold light oracles. I have six cards left. I have full health. I don't think he kills me here. Could potentially do a lot of damage to me, but I don't think he just kills me from 31. Especially if he's not branding it. We're gonna be rich. <laughs> what the? Uh... Oh, I'm surprised he didn't gang up Reno. I'm dropping that for sure. I think I do this. Just so there's no chance of... Um, I'm going to drop... Uh, I might need to see... Oh, I have one more in the deck. I'll drop him too. Basically, I want to get down to seven cards because I have three left. So I will draw the rest of my deck and not burn anything. Um, I wanted to kill Reno just in case there was some chance he got more. I'm, I'm very surprised he... Um, didn't gang up the Reno. Am I dead here? These are four draws. Two, three, four, um, five, fourteen. This was a gourmet meal. He must not have had. If he had two um, old lights there, you could have killed me. Okay, so I want you, you, holy shit, this is a lot of damage, isn't it? Oh, is it enough though? Should drop that earlier. Strike. It's hammer time. Okay, still enough. Oh, I thought I misplayed there. Is it, if I would have dropped that earlier, the two AOEs would have hit that and buffed the frothing even more. Alright. This deck is actually pretty good against Paladin because it has a lot. It has a lot of like AOE effects. Um, the problem is we just had a shit hand last game. This is much better. But yeah, between Whirlwind, you know, it's got the slams, the ghouls. Um, it can be pretty good against Paladin, just clearing boards of little shitters. I still can't believe this has no animation. It has to be a bug, though, right? <laughs> Just like, what a slap to the face um, for the whole 10 year anniversary celebration that the coin they give you doesn't even have an animation. Small indie company. I see last game, if we had, um, had been able to coin out the Fiery War Axe, I don't think we had a Fiery War Axe right away. That would have made a huge difference. Like, it really can't be stated just how strong this weapon was back in the day. Yeah. Even like Cruel Taskmaster. I, I was very sad when enough good cards came out to the point where I dropped Cruel, Cruel Taskmaster from my decks. Just because it was such a fun, it was, it was such a good card, right? It, it could enable like executes. It was good for pushing damage. Um, yeah, just a good all around card. Strike. It's not Noble Sack. Competitive spirit. Revenge. Okay. It's kind of funny that a lot of my games I've won so far have been through like frost, frothing berserker. I haven't been able to do too many grim patrons shenanigans. I wonder if I should just be more willing to drop him without the Warsong Commander. I'm just being too hesitant with him. I'm 
Feather Spear would have sucked there. But at least here he trades. Here's the board. Oh, Cruel Taskmaster, one of the one ones. Um, it might be Avenge again. None may steal our secrets. That's an interesting inclusion for an aggro paladin. Like, I cruel taskmaster that. Could execute that. I thought about dropping Warsong Commander too. Because <clears throat> I could cruel taskmaster, then charge it into the spider. And by some miracle. Actually, no, he would just trade this into the Warsong Commander. There's no way he lets it live. I think that's the safer play. <laughs> So it has to be Noble Sack. Which is good because Noble Sack would have made that Warsong Commander play a lot worse. So as long as he doesn't have a Mysterious Challenger here, not too bad. The Sludge Belcher is an interesting inclusion too. No problem. Yep. Just low with Evan Chill. It feels so bad, but no, I won't execute that. Because regardless, he has to trade both of these into the low with them. If this... Actually, no, I can't count. You do the spider in this whole ran recruit. I don't know why I thought low that was like a 6-6 six, six <laughs> for some reason. So 8 mana is... That is a nice draw. So he's got 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 damage on board. I might enter rage and execute that actually. Because next turn I want to do a patron turn. But I have just enough mana for it. I don't have enough mana for execute. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be safe. So yeah, next turn I'll go off with the patrons. Serious challenger? That'd be really annoying. Okay. None of them really a little bit too late. Um not, the only one that really sucks here is repentance. Okay. Like flashbacks. Um, no consecration, please. Consecration. Oh, man. Wow. I'm really surprised he just jammed the second one there. Yeah, that's good. Do I just War Song and Accolade? It's kind of weird, but it gets me an extra draw. No, I don't think I do. So, getting two important cards discounted. Also get a 4-4 four four on the board, which is nice. Oh god. Um, is there a world here where I win? That does suck, but, um, so what are these? Avenge? Competitive Spirits? There's no way it's Sacred Trial, right? Okay. 
We got Avenge, Competitive Spirit. There's no way it's Eye for an Eye either, right? <laughs> um, oh, it's, you know, it's not Noble Sack, which is huge. I just dropped the other one. Oh, man. So he's tell me like that attack got through. So Oh, it wasn't eye for an eye. I could have won there, but I didn't attack because I was so scared it was eye for an eye. There's no way that's... Uh, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, it's not eye for an eye. Because the last Mysterious Challenger played four secrets. And he had no eye for an eye. Okay. <laughs> Man, my hesitation almost lost me the game there. <laughs> Imagine losing. Eye for an eye almost isn't even a, a bad idea in this meta. 